Ola Electric is looking to raise 5,500 crores from the sale of 9.52 crore shares at a face value of rupees 10. Promoter Bhavi Shagarwal is looking to sell 3.5% of his personal stake in the company and a total of 4.7 crore shares. Out of the total fundraise of Rs. 5,500 crores, 1,264 crores will go towards the Giga Factory, 800 crores for debt repayment, 1,600 crores for R&D and about 350 crores for business expansion. As far as financials go, the total liability stands at Rs. 3,600 crore currently compared to 3,270 crore in FY23. Liabilities have doubled from FY22 to FY23 from 1,734 crore to Rs. 3,217 crore. The loss for the first quarter of FY24 came in at Rs. 267 crores. Losses in FY23 amounted to Rs. 1,472 crore versus Rs. 784 crore in FY22. Strong revenue growth for Ola Electric up almost 8x to Rs. 2,631 uh, 2, crore compared to Rs. 373 crore in FY22. Revenue for FY24 so far came in at Rs. 1,243 crore and this is nearly 50% of the FY23 revenue. The quarter 1 FY24 EBITDA loss came in at Rs. 218 crore compared to the FY23 EBITDA loss of Rs. 1,252 crores. In terms of future plans, the Giga factory in Tamil Nadu is likely to be operational by March 2024. Ola will produce cells in their own Giga factory for existing and future EV products. Deliveries of the Ola S1X in the 2 kilowatt hour capacity and 3 kilowatt hour capacity will begin by H1 of F525, that is next fiscal. Ola will commence deliveries of motorcycles in H1 of F526. The company is also looking to expand the portfolio to cover mass market motorcycles and scooters as well. The company has sold close to 2 lakh electric vehicles in FY24 so far. Capacity utilization was 37% in FY23. The employee attrition rate was 47% for the last fiscal. Now, in terms of risk factors that Ola uh, may face, and this is what the company has said in the DRHP, one, Ola may continue to incur operating losses in the near term. Any reduction or elimination of fame and PLI could adversely impact demand. Expansion of Ola future factory may be subject to delays, cost overruns and warranty reserves may not be sufficient enough to cover future warranty claims. This is all that Ola has said in the DRHP. Ola has also said that they will require a significant amount of capital which uh, they may be unable to obtain at favourable terms. In terms of the path to profitability, industry sources say Ola is projecting sales of 3 lakh units in FY24 and 9 lakhs by FY25. The company is hoping to achieve a bitter profitability of 6.6% by FI25.